wind and rain, we've had a lot of that today, could hurt all the work that's been done in the Revere Beach Sandcastle competition. Right now, the artists are working to protect what they have created so far. WBZ's Mike Sullivan is in Revere Beach with a look at the painstaking process. Some art stands the test of time. Others can wash away at any moment. There's sand everywhere, so everyone can relate to it. No, this isn't child's play. It's a profession. I've been competing for over 20 years now, all around the world. You'll find Rusty Croft behind this work of art. It's going to be a secret. He is competing in the International Sand Sculpture Competition in Revere. <laughs> Usually I get most of my ideas in the shower. I don't know why. I think I'm going with a Celtic horse. They have three days to put their pieces together. The first eight hours is just compacting the sand. To make the sand strong, it's like, it's rock hard. It's really, it's almost like concrete. Boke Atima is from the Netherlands. He's been at this. More than 20 years, I think. Between the two of them, they have some advice for you. If you're at the beach, though, there's one secret I can give you. <laughs> and that's it. That's all it takes. I'll let you in on the secret. It's using water, lots of it. What they're calling for tonight, however, is a whole different story. Heavy rains are expected to slam Revere. The basic form should be here still, even in a downpour, but a lot of the details will run off. The artists are surrounding their pieces with plastic sheets and spraying them with glue. I think right now I'm going to close up the forms and protect it from the weather that's coming tonight. It's the life of a temporary artist. So it's like life, right? Yeah. Take the good moments, savor it, walk on. In Revere, I'm Mike Sullivan, WBZ News. I just think that is the coolest talent. It's amazing, and you can't be too attached to it, yeah. right? So you're creating something beautiful that you know is going to disappear. I love that there are secrets, and I had no idea that they sprayed them with glue. Right. Well, hopefully that preserves them tonight. Next time I go to the beach, bring in the glue. <laughs>